Last night's explosive episode of Coronation Street saw Pat Fallon being stabbed in the chest by Anna Windus, played by Debbie Rush, and, as the life of the formidable villain came to an end after the dramatic and controversial storyline, Connor has spoken out about playing the murderous character in the soap. As he opened up about leaving his role, the actor was quizzed about whether he would miss the evil figure. However, the 57-year-old explained that he wasn't sure viewers were likely to forget Pat in a hurry. He replied, I am never going to escape him, am I? And I am very happy about all of that. He is a treat isn't he and he offers up so many possibilities. Connor McIntyre the actor went on to discuss how he is sad he will no longer portray the very controversial character. Considering whether he would miss Pat, Connor admitted, sure. He is a treat isn't he and he offers up so many possibilities. However, the artist hinted that he is unlikely to have the time to pine for his previous Coronation Street role, due to a number of upcoming projects. The artist, who co-runs the Alamo Project, a mentor initiative for emerging artists, in Plymouth, said, Working in my studio, the Alamo, will help with that, I am sure. And I am signed up for the Manchester Panto so me and Les Dennis will be playing the Ugly Sisters in Cinderella. What a beautiful counterpoint and the perfect antidote. The actor also opened up about filming for the shocking scenes, which saw the character shooting his own daughter Nicola Rubinstein, Nicola Thorpe, before holding Michelle Connor, Kim Marsh, hostage. Revealing Pat's dramatic end was filmed over two full weeks, Connor revealed he thought the experience was great. He continued, Pat Fellin is at his most formidable when he is quiet but the physical stuff is part of him too, that's the explosion with him that emanates from. Whitehaven was interesting because I am terrified of heights but I had worked with the crew before and had trust in them but I was hanging on the edge going, I'm glad there's a rescue boat down there. Next week, Coronation Street viewers can expect to see Rosie Webster, Helen Flanagan, seek revenge on her ex-boyfriend and Juan. In the episodes, Rosie will be joined by Olivia Radfield, Ariana Itar, as they attempt to plant drugs on the DJ after flying to Los Angeles. Ahead of the drama, the actress took to Instagram to share her excitement about starring in the soap. Days earlier, Ariana had shared a series of jaw-dropping snaps of herself as she modeled a range of s putting on a very busty display as she enjoyed a sun-soaked getaway. The star flaunted her tone physique and ample assets. Coronation Street continues on Monday at 7.30pm on.